My name is Jonathan Arnott and I'd just like to spend a few moments explaining to you why I've decided to put my name forward for the Police and Crime Commissioner elections here in South Yorkshire. I think really for me it was my family, it was growing up when I realised that I'd got a real passion for law enforcement. It's because my late grandfather worked as a police officer for most of his adult life and he'd always come back and tell stories about policing, about making the streets safer, about getting criminals, dangerous criminals, locked up. And he took pride in that job. And my father was a chairman of magistrates for a number of years right here in Sheffield. So throughout my childhood and as a young adult, I really had that passion for keeping our streets safe and for protecting local people's right to go about their daily lives without interference from crime and criminals. That's really why I believe that the criminal justice system in the country today has gone soft. I believe that we need to take a much tougher approach. I believe that we need to have sentences that mean what they say. And if that means that we have to build more prisons, then so be it. But I understand the other side of the coin too. My background is in teaching. I've chaired a charity which works with young people, disadvantaged children and young people at risk of turning to crime. So I also understand the need to work hard to prevent crime in the first place. My background really is in mathematics. I'm a master of mathematics and I believe that gives me experience. The experience to be able to stand up and scrutinise budgets effectively. I believe that we must squeeze every single penny possible out of the budget, out of bureaucracy. Let's cut those things and make sure that as much money as possible remains for making sure that we get frontline police back on the beat. Now, I do understand that there are some of the things that I've said already which the Police and Crime Commissioner can't affect directly. Some of those things mean standing up to central government. I'm the General Secretary of UKIP, the UK's fastest growing political party. And I believe that gives me a unique experience. I've stood up and debated toe to toe with government ministers on a number of occasions. So you know that if you elect me as your Police and Crime Commissioner, then you'll have somebody who is prepared to stand up to central government and not take no for an answer and say this is what the people of South Yorkshire need. But don't get me wrong, although I've worked in politics, I don't believe that a police commissioner's role should be about politics in any way. Quite the reverse. The police and crime commissioner's role is all about cooperation, about working together to ensure that the chief constable is held to account, to ensure that the police do their job in the most effective and efficient way possible. And that is why I am proud to announce to you that my Deputy Police Commissioner will be the independent councillor and former Liberal Democrat, Jack Clarkson. Now Jack is an extraordinary man, someone who brings decades of frontline policing knowledge to the team. He's someone who's spent years working with groups to support the victims of crime. And so together, we believe that as a team, we have the experience that we need to make the streets of South Yorkshire safer for you. That's why I'm asking you please, on November the 15th, please vote for me, Jonathan Arnott, as your Police and Crime Commissioner here in South Yorkshire. Thank you very much.